Okay, go ahead. Go ahead. Do it. See if I care. No, no, Scott. I didn't mean it. Listen to me. Hello? Hello? Bastard. You all right? Of course, I'm all right. Where are you going? Into town. Oh, will you please leave me alone? You're going into town. You're heading in the wrong direction. Look, I, I, I don't know what happened, but uh, why don't you let me call you a cab? Why? Why? So you can get home safely. I don't have a home. No home? I've been living with my boyfriend for over a year, and all of a sudden, he tells me we're through. And then I just phoned him to ask him why, and he wouldn't tell me. All he'd say is that I couldn't come back to our apartment. Well, what are you, what are you, what are you going to do? Call a friend in town, I guess. See if somebody will let me crash with them for the night. What about your parents? Uh, couldn't you stay with them? They're in Portland. And they don't care what happens to me anyway. Well, I own a motel not too far from here. And you'd be welcome to uh, spend the night in one of the empty rooms if you'd like. F-O-C, of course. What? Free of charge. Oh. But no, that's very nice of you, but I don't want to impose. You wouldn't be imposing. Co-workers ought to help each other out, don't you think? Is that why you covered for me today when I broke that pie plate? <laughs> yeah. I figured you'd get into more trouble for it than I would. You're not kidding. I've been working there four days, and I've broken a dozen dishes already. You sure it's all right if I stay at your motel? Oh, absolutely. Come on, let's get going. It looks like rain. <laughs> 